Hey traders, this is Tosh Bradley. I go by T Bradley 90 in the My Investing Club MIC community. Right now, we have a very special holiday discount sale going on for MIC members or anybody wanting to join. We have $200 off our annual yearly package and we have an unprecedented $1,000 off our lifetime package. And we are raising prices going into the new year. So if you want to take advantage of these discounts, they are only good and only available right now until December 31st. Take advantage. We will definitely, definitely be raising prices soon. Hey guys, it's Tom Diesel here at My Investing Club. Uh, welcome to another weekly recap. This week, I'm going to go over my trades as usual. Um, at the end, I will go over some of the Q&As. Uh, that you guys uh, been posting in after hours uh, so let's get on to it on Monday I traded CEI you can see here I shorted some you know near the 2.3 line and then cover most of you know at support and when it was through that support it bounced back and, you know I added some here not not you know big size but uh, you know just to add on to that and then quickly cover over at around two and yeah as you can see here on Monday yeah it went from 175 to 235 I mean 2.5 I, I was um, you know I had another order at 237 button didn't fail so you know and my plan was to short it uh, over near near near, near that 2.5 line and then cover uh stop would be over that which is you know um 2.6 or something so uh, if you look at this on daily yeah you can see it's it's completed right you know from when from when to 473 and then <laughs> you know 175 so yeah you can see here this one this candle right here that what I was aiming for and then it was pretty good yeah so that is that and uh, on Tuesday let me pull up here Tuesday it wasn't you know a slow day for us and I, I I was away on 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 this day on Tuesday and I was on my you know business trip so I couldn't do much. Uh, but um, I saw on the main chat and you know people talking about this and it it, it was a slow day and you know a lot of uh, setup there. Uh, I mean not 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 a lot of setup there and uh, you know couldn't find the proper setup to to trade kind of so uh, I was uh, looking at Jivo and let me pull this chart here yeah it's, you can see that on the daily it's just grinding right it's like it's it's, it's, it's not like the turd that I like usually yeah Oh man, this one is just like crazy. But as you you can see here, the the choppiness, it, it's not like uh, you know um, the normal turd. It would be like you know high right here and then it's slowly fade, fade, and then you see the wicks, wicks like that, and that's that's what I like it, you know more. But th this one, what I like is uh, this one right here. Yeah, on this day, it shoot from 2.4 to like 3.25, and then you know slowly, slowly die the whole pre-market. And I was aiming at this support, which is 2.5, this one right here. Yeah, and I was hoping you know in the morning it could pop right here, and then I shot it some, but uh, you know. I I was on mobile, so I, I you know I guess my execution is not fast enough. So and at that time I was looking for some other ticker. Now now I really couldn't remember which one it was. 
so I missed this move. Otherwise, I should have you know some bullets right here to 57, and then cover over here and you know for <coughs> 20 cents like 237, and that that should be it. But instead, you know I chased it a bit here, seeing I was trading on mobile, and I was uh, you know shorting 2.5 and risking over 2.6. I I uh, actually put my hard stops there. It's like a range order stop market order and then uh the cover target would be 2.4 which is just 10 cents you know not much but you know glad work so there's that on chivo and and you know and turn out it turn out to be that bottom here and then not looking back yeah so see this is a support that i like that's why my my target is there yeah so that's tuesday on uh, wednesday yeah wednesday was pretty good i did i traded uh asln and i even think i i um i had this uh live trade as well no not not this one yeah it was on on Thursday. Sorry, my bad. Yeah, this one. P no, this one. Chibo A S L N. Oh, I couldn't find it. Let's hold on. Let me find it one sec. Uh, yes, A S L N. It's right here. That's my. Yeah. Mm, yeah, I remember that. On on that day in the morning was good and and uh you know, I had uh you know, one of the client called me right before the open uh that to discuss some some over some business. So so I missed the morning move. Uh but it was, you know, I was pissed, but you know, it's, it's nothing you can do here. But as you can see in the pre-market, right? Went to 3 then uh it dies down here and then pop back to that three three is pretty clear line to me and then it can you know continue to fade down and right at open it pops back near that so it's it this is is this is a panic pop this is perfect you know uh that's uh, that's what i i would like to you know short it here and you know scale back to those to, to that three dollar line and risking over that 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 would be my trade in the morning but you know then i couldn't do anything uh, because i i missed that so what i did is that uh, hey traders this is tosh i go by t bradley 90 in the my investing club chat just wanted to reach out and say if you have any questions about mic Joining MIC, maybe you're a member already. You have three ways to contact myself personally and through MIC. You can hit our social media. You can hit me through PMs in chat, or you can contact us through my email at tosh at myinvestingclub.com. That's T-O-S-H at myinvestingclub.com. I will get back to you in a timely manner, and I'm saying this because I'm here to help, and I don't want anybody to be afraid to reach out and ask any question that they have. We are here for you guys. All right, see you guys.